So the Portland region has brought out a group of Supras today for dealer associates to check out, drive, and compare to a group of high performance sports cars costing three and four times as much. And what that's gonna demonstrate is how well the Supra performs in a high performance driving environment like a, like a racetrack, but it also showcases how easy the car is for someone who may not have professional driving skills. I just didn't think you could build a car w with such performance orientation and then handle unbelievable. This is a car you can drive to work on Tuesday, take to the track on Saturday. Uh, impressive, absolutely nailed it. I mean, if they were after something that was a great track car and fun to drive, it couldn't have been better. Absolutely nailed the car. The way it rotates on the track is amazing. The balance is perfection. Uh, screams for you to drive it. It would run with any car that's two and three times the money. My first time on a racetrack, I think I want to come back and do that again. I love this car. It's easier to drive. It's responsive. It's, it's just exciting to be in. It's appointed so nice inside. I have a Porsche GTS 911. Love it, but no comparison. I love this car much, much more. But here we are out in Las Vegas at the Speedway. I mean, I'm telling you what, this car is awesome. Um, I couldn't ask for a better experience. Uh, I thank uh, Toyota and the Toyota region in Portland here for doing what they did for us because this is uh, better than expected. I thought it was going to be fun, but it's over the top. This is uh, the, one of the highlights of my life. First impressions is f***ing awesome. It was excellent. Um, exceeded expectations, um, faster than I thought it would be, nimble, handled well. Uh, the, the performance overall, the, the acceleration was phenomenal, like uh, first time I, I put my foot to the floor. I do think it's a game changer. Uh, I think it blows away the hype, you know, all the hype was, that, you know, that Toyota wasn't delivering enough and they've definitely under-promised and over-delivered here. This is an amazing vehicle. How was it? That was amazing. Yeah? A lot of fun. To be an amateur driver with a professional driver telling you what to do, you, you just get better and better and better as you go. It was so exciting the last two laps. Uh, I was eager to start racing somebody. The new 2020 Supra way exceeded my expectations. <laughs> So tight, so quick in the corners, just so well built. I, I couldn't, I couldn't believe how well built it was, and how uh, how well engineered it was. It's awesome. I love that thing. I, I, I really do want to get one. Uh, the handling is superb. Uh, it's a very well balanced car. And honestly, when I came out here, I thought that I was going to see a different car than what I saw. And what I saw was a vehicle that uh, I could drive every day. And I was kind of surprised at that. Amazing. I mean, my, my, it exceeded my expectations way further than I had even had, could even have imagined. I mean, uh, the handling in the corners, the, the acceleration, the, just the balance that the car has, you never feel like you're out of control. I didn't know what the Supra's value was. Uh, I would say it was easily 100, 150K. The, the Supra, I would think, has got to be $80,000 or more. I would have thought the car might have been closer to 70. But it's a, it's a great car and the value is all there. 80, yeah. 85 would, would not be an out of this world number. $100,000? Why? Just because of the value of the performance in it. I'd put it over 100, easy. Really? It fits that category. Why? It just has everything the Porsche has. I was excited. I mean, honestly, like we, we had a pretty good idea what the car, how it was going to perform just by reading some stuff from Motor Trend, a couple other magazines out there. But to actually physically get behind the wheel and drive it with no limitations and have the people from Toyota say, hey, drive it, let's go, have a good time with it. It just, it blew us away. I myself, I was grinning every time they were like, yeah, go out there and drive it and have a hot lap. I'm like, oh yes, let's do this. Yeah. You know, you can control it easily, yeah. nicely, and uh, there's, there's no surprise, basically. And everything is switch off, traction control, everything. So it's poor, it's like the car as it is. There's no surprise. 
And, and by balance, you mean it's just balance, front and rear, so that when we go into the corner, it's smooth and nice, and front and rear follow the same. No one can take the inside. Stay out. Thank you. Thank you very much. Hope you had fun. Oh, I, 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 I do that every day. <laughs> Yeah, baby. <laughs> and show me a cat getting scratched. <laughs> there you go.